today I am going to put these little chicks outside in the hen yard, um, loose. Um, but we're going to bring this X pen out there so they can go in and out as they please. And it will be their shelter for at night while they're getting used to living outside. So this, hi, <laughs> hi, sweetie. Oh, come here, buddy. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you scared me. Uh, oh, Hura, you're friendly. No, sweetie. Oh. Oh, okay. My husband's got the garage door open, so I can't let Ohura just jump up on me like I usually do. <laughs> no, it's I gotta get them out of here, honey. It's okay. Thank you, though. Um. Anyway, where was I? There. This should be the last time that they're in the garage. I've been wanting to take them outside for a while now, but I don't want it to be. The weather's been weird, and I don't want for them to be on their first day outside and have like a thunderstorm that would like scare them. Okay, now the first thing I want to do is to get all of the adult pens. Hi guys! And then and this is a good way to get them here. Nothing, nothing makes them come running like corn or any treats. Chickens love food. Anyway, I'm throwing some corn here just to get them out of the hen yard, okay, so that I can shut this door. Yeah, I'll show you. There. There's that door. Okay, I am going to shut this door. And I lock it. That way, I keep them separate, okay? They're not ready to be together yet, okay? Chickens, we'll talk more another time about like chickens and like the pecking order and like there is all kinds of really fascinating stuff that goes on when in the hierarchy of of chickens. But uh, um, we're going to keep them separate for now. Okay, I'm going to be transferring the chicks out of the X pen and into a carrier to transport them to the hen yard. So... I closed the garage door. This way, Ohura won't be able to escape outside because she's pretty friendly. And when I open the, the top, she I love it that she wants to jump out and see me. But with the garage door open, that wasn't very safe. And and these chicks right now are they're kind of at like a sweet spot where they are. Hi, sweetheart, come on up. Hi, hi, good girl. They're kind of at a sweet spot right now, and um, where where they're still young enough to be light, you know, not like not heavy, but they have a lot of feathers, and this makes them to be really good flyers. Um, when they get older, they won't be as good of flyers because uh, they'll be heavier birds. And my birds, I think, tend to be a little fat because I kind of spoil them. Don't I? I spoil you guys. I do, I know. I spoil you. I spoil you. Good girl. I think she can't wait to be outside. Hi, honey. I know, that's new. It's probably scary. It's probably scary. Don't worry, I'll get you a friend though, okay? Let me get you a friend, Okura. Good girl, good girl. Hi. Who wants to be next? Hi, honey. Hi. Come on up, buddy. Come on up. Nurse Chapel. Look at Nurse Chapel. I love her. I think she and Okura might be my favorites. Don't tell the other chicks. <laughs> Who's next? Hi! Are you curious? What's going on? What's going on with your sisters? What's going on with your sisters? Do you want to go see them? Are you going to jump off? I think you're, you're looking for a place to jump to. 
Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you, honey. I'm not gonna hurt you. You're so soft and sweet. <laughs> yes, you're soft and sweet. You're cute. I gotta start getting you guys treats. I think that will help me feel friendlier. Ready? Go with your friends. Good girl. I know you're the last one. It must be lonely in there. Don't worry. There you go. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You want to be with your sisters? I'm going to try to break this down. Um, fold it up, get it back there, and then, um, and get them out of here as quick as they can, because that's small and it's unfamiliar, and, and it's got to be not comfortable for them. But I strung an extension cord so that they could have their little light. Um, chickens, um, don't see very well in the dark. And I always have a little night light for them to be able to find their perch. And there's something very, very, I don't know, comforting and sweet. When you see them and it's dark and they're all huddled in and they've got a little light. I'll show you tonight. I'll take a little footage and, and you'll see what I mean. The Germans have a word for it. It kind of means snuggly and safe. And I want my chickies to feel that way. Um... I took the floor that I had created for the X-Pen and I put it on top as a roof this time. Um, it should be fairly waterproof because it is covered with a um, an old plastic shower curtain. Um, but it's pretty temporary. They're only going to be out here for a while. And then my wish is to integrate them with the older hens once they're bigger and stronger and better able to fend for themselves. Okay, it's time for the chickies big moment. All right, let's see. I'm just gonna try to open the door and I'm gonna sit quietly and let them come out on their own. I'm very curious to see how they do. Hi, girls. I think that's Okura in the front. I'm not sure how much you can see from way over there. I kind of wanted to, to film. Hi! Well, that is a surprise because these two, these two are, are like hand shy compared to the rest of them. I mean, compared to most chickens, they're pretty dang friendly. But these two, compared to the other ones who are like really friendly, they're a little shyer. I am shocked that Ohura is still inside. Seven of nine and Ohura, I am shocked. Because in the garage, they're the bravest ones. Ohura was the one who, who tried to jump out onto my shoulder. <laughs> hey guys. Hey, buddy. Hi. Oh, dear. Uh, one of them went inside the house. Oh. She totally wants to eat you guys. It's not your fault, but chicken is delicious. Everybody wants to eat you guys. I'm sorry, but you're safe here. No one's gonna eat you. I promise. Your eggs, that's another story. Hey, look, they all went inside. See, familiar. They love familiar. That was pecking order behavior, what we just saw. Nurse Chapel found a worm. Okay, now she brought it over here to eat it. Good girl, Nurse Chapel. 
What you got, a prize? Now this is an entirely new food for her. She brought it over here because she just wanted to make sure that she could keep it. She wanted to, <laughs> it's okay, no one's gonna take your worm. Don't worry, if anybody comes and tries to take your worm, I will not let them. That's your prize, honey. Good girl, Nurse Chapel. Oh, she is loving that worm. Oh my goodness, they are gonna be so freaking happy out here. I am so glad for them. Yeah, that's a good worm. <laughs> good girl, your first worm, honey, your first worm. Now, these girls seem pretty indifferent to having the chicks out here. Um, Lucky certainly is not indifferent to having the chicks out here. Hello, chickies. Look at them. Um, when I came out here, everybody was in the enclosure with the exception of, it's kind of dark, I think it was Ohura. And Ohura was perched up on the edge of one of the water barrels. And her her wings seemed a little bit wet. Like she gave it a little dip. Um, I don't want them to get cold. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um I'm gonna cover their enclosure with a blanket just to make sure that, you know, because they're not used to like having a breeze or anything. Okay. I don't know if you can see this or if it's too dark, but hi guys, it's just me. I'm going to pull this back, okay? But as you can see, my little babies, I got a couple of blankets. It's okay in there. Chill out, it's just me, honeys. Okay. Good night, babies. Good night.